Hi everyone, this is Akas Bhagat from Fastest India Group. So in this video, we will be going to understand about the two main category of uh, unsupervised machine learning. That is clustering. And the other one that is uh, that comes under the unsupervised machine learning is the I'm just forgetting yeah association so what is what we can understand with clustering and association so we can say that uh, after uh, the clustering will do association then how this uh, in what way we proceed let's understand in a, a deep manner so what happens in classification is that uh, I'll just give an example you have received some data from a mall that have a lot of uh, goods to be sold in that mall okay so based on that data you have find out that you have to find out how many people have bought highest product and what is the product so based on the available data you can make some predictions like uh, 7k of people have bought uh, milk from the shop 5k pe people have bought what we can say biscuits from the shop or 9k of people have bought beer from the shop so what happens here is that as per the available data set we have divided the data into clusters and that cluster give us the information that in what amount of people involved with a certain goods and product so what inside we are getting is that we are getting different clusters that have a capability related with certain products so this kind of machine learning algorithm that will help us find out the insight within a data set we don't know what uh, the outcome can be we don't have any training set we just get the data and based on that data we have developed certain outputs so that kind of output that you have recently seen is called clustering now let's understand what is association so it is association is a bit advanced from clustering so what association does is that it will find out a relation among the clusters like among the 9k people that have brought beer if we have find out that those who have brought milk in which Three K people are only interested in buying milk, and a five K people are interested in buying buying milk as well as beer. 
so will get a association result then apart from all the available people most of the people those are buying beer along with the beer they are also buying milk okay so that is a type of associations we have find out now how we are going what help we will get with that insight so we can see that those people who are buying beer are also buying milk and it's in a large amount large portion of data so what we can do is that where we place the beer we can put the milk just near to it to increase the sale because we have got some insight relation from the data set data set is explaining too much things to us that people who are interested in buying this one product will also buying the other product in a ratio more than 50% so that kind of insights will <laughs> get uh in case of associations so we can understand that this is the uh a bit insights of what is clustering and what is association